Hello, today I'm going to show you how to wirelessly connect your Verizon Files router to your wireless enabled computer. Every Verizon Files router ships with wireless on and security enabled. Every unit has its unique ID and password, and that information is listed on the label on the back of the unit. It's a good idea to write down this information before you begin setup. Here we've written down the router's wireless information on a sheet of paper. Next, on a wireless capable computer running Vista, right click on the wireless icon in the system tray. When the contextual menu appears, select Connect to a Network. A window appears listing all available wireless networks. Select the router's network by the ESS ID name you wrote down on the piece of paper, then click Connect. In the next window, you'll be asked to enter a password. Enter the web key as the password. Make sure that you enter the web key exactly as it is written on the label, including capitalization. Then click Connect. Once you've successfully connected to the wireless network, make sure that the boxes next to Save This Network and Start This Connection Automatically are checked. Then click Close. Finally, select the location for the wireless network you just connected to. Congratulations! You've connected your Verizon Files router to your computer. For more helpful information, go to www.actiontech.com slash how to.